After you've set up your teams and your templates, you are ready to start scheduling. When you make a new plan, you can choose a template to import to each plan. Once your plan is created, you'll see that everything in your template has been added. We're in a single plan, but it's usually better to schedule multiple weeks at a time. So let's go into the matrix. First, close the other sections and expand our hospitality team to see who's scheduled and who's needed for the next couple weeks. This particular plan has one person scheduled, but still needs the rest of our template. Click the template button, choose your template, and when we import it, it imports the template to this plan, but leaves what was already there. Our template already has some people in it. To fill out the rest of our schedule, we need to fill each of these needed positions. When you click one, you'll see all the people you've assigned to the position, plus any potential alerts. If someone has blocked out a date, is already scheduled somewhere else, or has other scheduling preferences, you'll see those here. You can schedule them anyway, but for now, we'll choose someone with no conflicts. You can fill the rest of your needed positions one by one, or you can use auto scheduling by clicking the button at the top right. Select your team and Planning Center fills all your needed positions for you, choosing the first person who hasn't served in the longest time and who has no conflicts. Now that our people are scheduled, we need to let them know. When you schedule people, an email notification is prepared. You can see that this notification is ready to go by the email icon right next to their name. The email hasn't been sent yet, so this plan will not show up in their schedule. Once you're ready to notify them, from the top right, click Email These People. Make sure only your team is selected, and then click Next. After you write your email and click Send, you'll get a confirmation that your emails have been sent. The email icon will disappear for everyone you emailed, and all of those people will get one email with all of their requests. Now you just have to wait for their responses. For more information on setting up the matrix, check out our matrix video. And to learn about other ways you can set up your teams, check out our Team Types tutorial.